Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Kevin and this is The Wrench and Fool. In this video I wanted to go over an issue that I used to have with my 2019 Chevy Bolt EV. Now I don't have the car anymore. I, I sold it or traded it in I should say on a, a trade repurchase for a 2022 Bolt EUV. So I don't have the 2019 anymore. Um, but the reason I'm doing this video is because I've been going back and editing some videos that I filmed quite a while ago, um, some of which are covering and still including things on my 2019 Bolt. And there's been some semi-uncontrolled rants in some of those videos uh, that were triggered by charging issues that I was having with Electrify America. Uh, up to and including going to charging stations, trying every single charger there, and not being able to charge at any of them. And so I wanted to pass along some information that I learned from an Electrify America customer service agent, um, particularly after I called during that stop when I couldn't charge at any of the stations. So the fault that I would have is I would plug into the station, activate the charge, everything would seem like it was going along okay, and it might just start to charge for 30 seconds to a minute and then it would stop and have a fault. Uh, other times it would have a fault almost immediately, like it wouldn't even start charging, it would just have a fault. And it happens many, many times, over and over and over, and I was getting really upset about it, and I always blamed it on Electrify America because it only ever happened at Electrify America stations. What I was told by the Electrify America customer service agent is that there is an issue with the bolt where when you're using a station that has a liquid cooled cable like the Electrify America stations do, it puts strain on the connector, the charging connector on the bolt. And in some cases it can be enough that it interrupts some connection somewhere and causes a charging fault. It causes the charging to stop. And so what they suggest that I should do is once I plug the bolt in, just kind of lift up a little bit on the back of the cable. Not really pushing up hard, but really just enough to sort of support the weight of the cable. And they suggested that I should do this for about a minute or until the screen on the charger says, thank you for choosing Electrify America or whatever it says. So I called them when I was not able to charge, when I was at a station where I tried every single charger and it wouldn't work. And so immediately after getting off of the phone with them, I tried what they suggested and it worked perfectly. After that, every time I charged my 2019 Bolt, I would do the same thing. I would always hold, it, hold up on the charging cable uh, until it got past that point. Uh, and I never had an issue, or at least that issue, charging the Bolt again. Now it's not gonna solve a broken charger. It's not gonna fix a broken charger. It's not going to solve other charging issues, whether it's with the charger or with the vehicle. It's just for this specific problem. But I wanted to pass that information along. Um, one, because there's a lot of other bolts out there that could potentially have this same issue and benefit from that information. But also because I'm going to be editing out a lot of those rants in the older videos uh, as I'm going through them now, because it's, it, I was blaming it on Electrify America. It's not solely their fault. And so, I want to update that information, remove my outdated rants now that I actually know what the problem is and know how to address it. Um, and so I'm just making this video as sort of a coverall for those uh, videos that I'm going to be editing. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. Thanks for watching. 